Hi everybody, Michelle Seguin here and thanks for watching this video. Today I want to talk about complaining and why you need to stop complaining. Uh, I was on the phone yesterday and somebody was telling me, oh my god, did you hear that the government has just decided to spend 1.25 million dollars on new computers for those Syrian refugees who led into the, co the country? And no, I hadn't because I avoid the media like the plague because there's absolutely nothing good in there for me and my personal growth and the success of my life. So I avoided it. It's not for me. And this person was really upset about it. I was, they were completely outraged. And I was like, why are you complaining about this? Why are you, you know, putting your, your negative vibration and bringing that into me and having me have to block it? Like, why are you talking about this? How did that affect your life? Yeah, okay, it's your money. It's your tax dollars. I get it. But what, what are you going to do about it? Are you going to get up and protest? Are you going to go see your local representative? Are you going to march on parliament and make a change? No, you're not. You're just going to complain about it, which is a complete waste of time. If something bothers you that much that you have to complain about it, act on it. Because other than that, you are wasting your time and you are wasting my time. And you're lowering the quality of your life. You are never going to get anywhere if all you do is complain. I was a gold medal complainer when my life was in the toilet. I loved complaining. I tell you, the only thing I liked more than complaining was food. Let's see where that got me. So basically, I learned to stop complaining. I'm not saying I never complain, because I definitely do, but just this pointless complaining. Like, what was the point of that? You know, if you want change in your life, you need to act. It makes me think of like back in the day when women didn't have any rights and they couldn't vote. Do you think that women just stood around and complained, oh, this really sucks, men are horrible, we can't do nothing. Or did they get up? Did they act? Did they rally? Did they make changes? They took initiative. That's, that, that's, it's, it, that's what you're gonna see the world over. When you are being held down with something bothers you that much, stand up and do something about it or shut up about it and don't bring that negativity into my life and keep it out of yours for the love of God. So this really, you know, it really brought that to mind. I was just like, this is what we do. We complain. We complain about stuff. We complain to others. And we just spread that negativity around like a fog. That's why everything sucks. So if there's something in your life that, that you don't like, that you're complaining about constantly, are you doing anything to change it? If you're not, either stop complaining about it or act. Do something and change it so you have nothing to complain about. And if you have somebody in your life that is a complainer, maybe distance yourself from them a little bit. That's what I did. Uh, toxic people, they're not bad people, but they're, they're negative vibrations, especially when you're trying to change you. You gotta get away from that because that's just gonna slow you down. And trust me, you don't wanna slow down. You wanna full steam ahead into a good life. So that's what I really wanted to share is the importance of cutting complaining out of your daily routine. Get away from that negative media. Stop watching those god-awful reality shows where everybody is like cranky and, and whatever. I, I used to watch Catfish because I thought it was really funny. And, uh, but all I would do was complain and be negative and be like, why are they doing that? Didn't they figure this out? Blah, 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 blah. And I was like, w it was a complete waste of my time as most TV is. But yeah, so basically complaining, it's toxic. It's going to slow down any progress that you're making in your life and you want to get rid of it. And anybody who's complaining to you, you know, gently tell them that you're not interested in listening to that or maybe bombard them with positivity. Maybe they'll just go away on their own because that's another thing that I've learned is that negative people don't like positive people and they will just disappear. And they're gonna go find other people they can complain to who like the complaining, who complain back and they'll just bicker da -da 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 in their corner while you're full steam in the head this way to a better life. So yeah, complaining, cut it out or act on it, one or the other. But you cannot have a negative complaining attitude and a good life. It, it just it doesn't work, water and oil. All right, so I hope that you like this video. I've got many more coming. Please subscribe, leave a comment, follow me on Facebook, on Twitter, subscribe to my blog. All the links are below. I've got many more stuff coming for you and I'm looking forward to seeing you guys further along on this journey. Thank you, bye.